as we are trying to adhere to our laws and rules in the country, which, of course, demand that such charges, of course, need the appropriate legal and policy approval, which we all support. I think some of the comments, I'm quite not happy with them because my senior leader of the opposition party knows clearly that under this regime, I'm a member of the finance committee, he's talking about we're taking steps to deal with all these challenges. He knows it took us <laughs> not a number of days, weeks, even if not months. So if we speak as if at present the country is highly taxed and stuff like that, Mr. Speaker, I'm surprised because that statement is not in good faith. Do we have a time to say taxes are high or low? It depends on the fiscal space situation of our country, and he knows that. Mm. Mr. Speaker, what I can say is that I think we need to refer this so that the minister in charge will be given the appropriate opportunity to come and answer questions on that. But if we say that it should be just tomorrow, we don't even know his situation now. I think as a house, we need to adhere to the needed balance when it comes to our political interests and state issues. Other than that, I think I support what he's saying. But the fact that he's saying that the country is becoming uh, over highly taxed and stuff like that, I always refer to them that between 2014 and 2016, 26 tax items were either introduced or increased. So they shouldn't talk about that. Mr. Speaker, tax issues once and for all, we need to deal with them in our country because it's one of the issues destroying our country. When MPC they are in power and they are introducing taxes, MPP will say no. When MPP they are in power and the MPC will say no, and the public will follow them. So we are failing to apply the needed methodology and policy direction and options in managing our fiscal policy. And then when we borrow to say that to did it. So what do we do? How do we finance our programs? It is time that we put I mean, we put this political stance somewhere and build a new point of convergence as a country and stop recycling all these uh, complaints. But other than that, I support that, that if indeed uh, the airport authority is doing that, it is not in love with our laws. And we need to ask the minister to come and answer. But in doing so, let us eschew all forms of political interest as definitional elements. That will draw in unnecessary uh, 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 complaints and debates that will not be very functional to what we want to do as a country. Thank